What's up subscribers? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll be talking about some updates for a nouveau stock, trading under the ticker INUV. But first, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe so that you get notifications about our future videos talking about the stock market and personal finances. And while you're down there, if you haven't already, be sure to check out the links in the description to get your free shares of stock from Webull whenever you open and fund your account, as well as $10 of free Bitcoin from Coinbase whenever you open your account and make your first $100 purchase of cryptocurrency. And don't forget to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm and to help support my channel. So grab a cup of coffee or your favorite beverage of choice and let's jump into it. We last talked about Anuvo stock here on my channel about a month ago. And since that time, Anuvo stock has been in a significant downtrend, selling off over the past month. With the stock currently trading at around 72 cents per share at the time that I'm recording this video. But despite the ongoing sell off, Anuvo management recently provided investors with some positive updates whenever they released their quarterly report which they released on August 12th, announcing a revenue increase of 66% year over year for the second quarter. With IntentKey leading the way, performing 74% better than their clients' goals with its 50% year over year and 37% sequential growth indicative of those results. And CEO Rich Howe expecting to see a continuation of double digit year over year growth throughout the second half of 2021. Getting back to Anuvo's results, financially for the second quarter and the first six months of 2021, Anuvo reported a net revenue of 12.6 million and 23.3 million respectively. Substantial growth year over year. With this resulting in a gross profit for the second quarter and first six months of 2021 of 10.4 million and 19.5 million respectively. But despite the growth in revenue, Anuvo continued to lose money, announcing a net loss for the second quarter of 2.4 million, which was up from 1.4 million year over year. So with all of that being said, what are my thoughts about Anuvo as an investment? For those of you who have been following my channel for a while, you know that Anuvo is an investment that I've been holding in my stock portfolio. While it's no secret that Anuvo is a very small market cap speculative penny stock, currently trading with a market capitalization of approximately $80 million, it's a company that for the long term, I still believe has a lot of potential ahead of it. But with that being said, due to the speculative nature of the company, Anuvo is an investment that I will never let become a very large percentage of my overall stock market portfolio. But despite the competition and other inherent risks with an investment in Anuvo, there's no denying that intelligent advertising is going to continue to be the way of the future. So I plan to hold my shares of Anuvo for the long term. But just remember, my videos are never medical or financial advice. They're merely me researching a company and talking about my opinions about that company based on my research. An investment in Anuvo, like an investment in any company, has risks. So before you make an investment in Anuvo stock, make sure you're doing your own research and only investing if you're willing to accept those risks. What are your thoughts about Anuvo? Are you invested in Anuvo? Are you thinking about investing in INUV? Where do you think the share price is going over both the short term and the long term? Be sure to comment down below and let me know what you think. And while you're down there, if there are any other stocks or topics that you would like me to talk about in a future video, please feel free to comment that down below as well. As a reminder, this video is for entertainment purposes only. I am not a certified financial planner. I'm a resident physician with an interest in personal finances and investing. Please make sure you're doing your own research before you make any financial decisions. And please be sure to smash that like button and click on the subscribe button for the YouTube algorithm and to help support my channel. Thanks everyone. Have a great day.